Hey Laura, let's take a look at your feature assignment. Um, next time be sure to include your caption with your submission. If you don't see a way to do that, then you can always just add it to the assignment comments. Let's check and see if it's in Photoshop and under the file info. And there it is. Good job. Automotive enthusiast gathered. That's redundant. Gathered together. Gathered at the Whole Foods parking lot off of Archer Road to admire. I would just say show off. You don't know. You, it's not for you to say if they're admiring the cars. Um, to show off their cars. Uh, because it's not a proper noun, you don't need an on. So, their cars, Sunday, January 13, 2019. Good. This free event will take place. Um, so, here you would say this free event takes place. On the second Sunday of each month. Photo by your name. Good job. <laughs> Let's look at your take. Only 33 images. Uh, that's not great. So you had uh, a week to find something and photograph it. Um, you need to put in more effort if you're going to succeed in this class and in this field. Um, but you can do it. So here we go. This is Photo Mechanic. It's the program I use to edit um, down photos before I open them up in Photoshop. It helps me um, just you know choose between images. Over here, it, it gives me all the info from your lens to your ISO, aperture, shutter speed, exposure, compensation if you used it, what program you're using what camera you're using, the date and time the photograph was taken. So it's just a tool in helping me help you become a better photographer. I know there's a lot of standing around at these these shows. Um, this is pretty nice. It's not in focus. Let's try to figure out why. Um, no reason why it shouldn't be in focus. So just a little misfocus. It looks like it's focused over here instead of on the people. Um, but you took more of them. Good. I, I, uh, I, I, I wish you had come down a little bit so you didn't crop off his hand. <clears throat> Excuse me, even if it was in his pocket. But I really like this. Uh, it's like father-son moment, it, it feels like. Um, I think this is stronger than the photo you turned in. Uh, possibly you didn't get their name or they didn't want to talk to you, but it's a nice job. Oh, it's getting better. Yeah, even like that, maybe with some kind of crop like that. These are these chrome wheels I was talking about that sometimes you can make some really good reflections in people walking by. Sometimes uh, try to think outside the box. Think about doing things what you know what other people wouldn't. Take risks. Ask the owners of the car if you, you know you can sit in them for a little while and and photograph out the window people walking by or use the the rearview mirrors to to make an image. <laughs> what is this doing there? That would have been a nice juxtaposition if it had a real nice car on either side. <laughs> it's almost a moment. You need the dog's the dog's foot, but that that's kind, of, that's kind of funny. It's 
Guy holding a stick. All right. Um, definitely have several photos to choose from. We just uh, need to get people's names, but uh, definitely need to take more photos as well. So let me know if you have any questions at all.